Hello everybody, welcome back to New Game Spotlight. This is Christmas Cat by Bart Bonte. Um, normally I would go one screen ahead and just go to main menu if there isn't, but um, that just it doesn't happen at all. My native language is in here. So that combining with the name of the developer means, um, and the fact that these are the two other native languages of my country, means I'm pretty sure that... Uh, the man who created this lives pretty darn close by, and his name should actually be pronounced as Bart Bonte. In any case, we're not going to go with Dutch, because um, yeah, this is Dutch, this is German, this is French. Um, we're going to go with English, because most of my audience is English-speaking. Anyway, play this game and the other Bont Cat adventures on mobile in the Where's Cat app. So there you go. Anyway, Christmas Cat. It's a puzzle game created in Flash, if you haven't already. Alright, that takes care of that. The description is the following. The Bounty Cat jumps on the Christmas tree and sends the 20 red balls all around the house. Merry puzzling. Well, a bit, a bit late for that, but... Uh, See if we can find. There, there is more to it than just finding all the things you need. Um, it's an entire point and click adventure game, to be honest with you. So, uh, yeah. Just click on all the things. I might finish this one straight up, which is probably fine. That's the weirdest microwave I've ever seen. Why the hell would you have a lock on your drawers? I mean, I get it from a standpoint, from a game creative standpoint. Why is that cat on every single... This man really does love his cat, doesn't he? More codes to be had, it seems. More codes, it seems. Hmm. More socks. Well, I think we've gotten all the easy ones. And at uh, this point, we're here to... Ah, wait a minute. Where is it? There we go. Left, right, left, left, right. Let me just notch that down somewhere. Let's see. Left. Right. Left, left. Right, 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 left. Let's get back to the microwave now. Let's see. So, left, right, left, left, right, 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 left. Ding! Oh, yeah. Solve the puzzle. We've seen the gingerbread men as well before. And the candy canes. But uh, it doesn't look like we'll be taking these off of their imprisonment on the shelf. Well, that's probably not a shelf. Can I leave this present? Ah, there you go. You enjoy that. I'll leave you to it. And uh, when I get back, you'll probably have that uh, sorted out, won't you? There's a gingerbread again and the candy canes, but I don't see... Ah, there you go. Thank you. Did you go on here? Yes. Candy cane. All right, let's see if we can find some more environmental clues to solving the puzzle. Let's see, gingerbread cane star. Let's see if we can do that. Gingerbread cane star. There we go. Nice. I want to close that thing again, but alright, it's fine. Do 
we get anything out of this? I think we could. How many gingerbread men do we have? Yeah, this is the same logo. Alright. Well, let's notch it down. How the hell am I going to do that one, though? Okay, let's do it in that way. Right. Left. Down. Left. Up. So, right. Left. Down. Left. Up. Sweet. Merry Christmas! Yay! You do it. Okay, and these is this is a solution to the other thing. Um, I notch that down again. Let's go up, right, left, left, up, down, up. Where did I see these? Why the hell did I note those down if there's no way to... What? Ah, here we go. Whew. Up, right, left, left, up, down, up. <coughs> cool. Flashlight. There's our cutie. Alright. Before I pick up that last thing, a uh, few things. Well, about this game, because I'm pretty sure this is the end when I pick that up. Uh, that was pretty fun, right? Um, short, simple puzzles, environmental clues you have to figure out for yourself. It's a great way to be invested, and as far as point-and-click adventures go, it didn't go with the really obscure solution things. You know what I'm talking about, like, tie a piece of cheese to a totem pole so a mouse comes up and tilts the balance of it slightly to the left, causing it to tumble into a house, which then flies off a shingle, which you can then use to solve a puzzle or something bizarre like that. No, kept it simple, kept it easy. A nice little thing. Uh, let's finish it. Merry Christmas. And now our cat is... Wow. Well, I'm not ending it on as long as this is going on. Unless this gives me a copyright claim. And I don't think I will. But I think I might as well end it here. A bit too late for Christmas, but uh, still worth to be shown, I suppose. Yeah, look at him go. Anyway, this is where I'm going to cut it. So thank you guys for watching. Hope you're still enjoying the series. Feel free to show support by coming, liking, and or subbing if you haven't done already. And I'll see you guys on the next episode. Bye, everyone.